Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nadine if you are new here and I am on a trying to conceive journey. I'm pretty darn excited to be doing this video because some crazy things have happened and I can't wait to tell you guys. First off, I am at the tail end of my two week wait. I believe I have five days to go before AF shows up. So in five days I could technically take a pregnancy test. Probably about a week or so ago, my breasts were sore. They're not sore now. It didn't even last long, maybe like a day, not even that, maybe a couple hours, which was weird. And it's always weird when that happens because usually when my period, right before my period come, my breasts don't do anything. Like they don't feel different. They don't feel sore or anything. It's definitely not a symptom for me, but on occasion it does happen. Like the last time it happened was so long ago and I was like, oh my gosh, maybe this is a pregnancy symptom and blah, blah, blah. Which yes, it can be a pregnancy symptom, but in my case it was not. So I just, I didn't take it to heart the other week when my breast became sore. The other thing was, um, actually yesterday morning before my alarm clock went off at 5 a.m. Um, I actually had a dream and my dreams are very vivid and it's almost like I'm watching myself in these dreams. I have this dream that I'm coddling my son and well actually he's coddling me. He climbs up on the chair and I pick him up and he just gives me this great big old little hug and it made me so say aw and after I said aw I actually said his name. And it's very strange because I have had dreams before where I've dreamt that I'm a mom. You know, sometimes it's, it's oh, I need to slow down. <laughs> sometimes it's with a little girl, sometimes it's with a little boy, and sometimes um, it's a baby and it's very gender neutral. I can't tell if it's a boy or a girl. And there is no like feeling of whether it's a boy or a girl. Sometimes I just know it's a boy or a girl but I never, ever, ever, ever say the child's name, nor do I ever feel like I know what the child's name without saying it is. So to have this dream yesterday morning and actually say the child's name was very weird and very like, oh my gosh, kind of, um, it was very, I don't wanna say, it might have been spiritual, but I'm kind of like, I have had dreams of kids before and obviously I want to be a mom. If you would have asked me when I was five years old, 10 years old, 12 years old, I would tell you my dream would, was to become a mom. So it could be just me dreaming about becoming a mom, wanting to be a mom, um, or maybe I subconsciously met my son, who knows? <laughs> So I just really wanted to document this just in case that's the case. Um, I do believe that kind of stuff happens. I just don't believe it happens to me. So if God, Jesus is telling me something, then I am definitely going to document it. So this little boy was adorable. He had blonde hair and I want to say he had maybe like hazel greenish eyes. Um, and he was just this, tiny little cute little thing he was um probably like 18 months old or something he was just so adorable he was in these cute little like long johns dinosaur kind of pajamas like it was white and then it had the dinosaurs on it and then like the 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 cuff part of the sleeves and the legs were like the hunter green um but he was just adorable he was so cute and I mean, I don't know if this dream is telling me that, you know, don't give up, you will be a mom. Or if this dream is telling me I am a mom right now as we speak, or that it's gonna happen very, very soon. And perhaps I did just meet my little boy, who knows? So I definitely wanted to share that with you guys and really see if anybody else has had this kind of dream where you have met 
your child before actually giving birth, before actually finding out if you were pregnant. I would love to hear your stories on that. Um, or even if you know somebody, um, please share. I don't even know what to say. It's just, it, it's very interesting. Like I was blown away of the fact that I actually said his name in the dream. Like it's, it's mind blowing to me. So, I mean, it's very cool if I actually met my son before actually giving birth or knowing I was pregnant. I mean, that would be totally awesome. So, so that was that. So the next thing is I have been spotting, which again, five days away. So that could be me just spotting earlier, but usually I only spot like one or two days beforehand. It's five, but again, I was spotted even earlier than this and it was just nothing. So I guess we'll just wait five days and see what happens. Which if I'm not pregnant right now, it's okay because if my period is going to come right on time, that's totally fine with me because who wants to be um, on cycle day one on their wedding day, which my wedding day is September 22nd and it's what like two weeks and some days away so if it wants to start within this next week i am totally fine with that if i'm not pregnant right now i'd much rather be pregnant right now but if i am not pregnant that's totally fine because i really don't want af to start any later because if that happens then i just don't want to feel yucky and gross and bloated on my wedding day i just don't want that to happen so I am okay with it starting early or right on time and I have said this in a previous video as well that my fertile week will actually be during our honeymoon week so honeymoon baby here we come um, fingers crossed I feel like everything you know how everything just falls into place I feel like this dream is kind of making everything fall into place or it's telling me very soon which this month would be very soon I don't know I'm just like I'm trying not to put my hopes up that high but with this dream I can't help it so I'm either going to be super happy or I'm going to be crushed at the end of this month so stay tuned for that <laughs> um but I am looking forward to getting married and I am looking forward to our honeymoon so that is the update for now with trying to conceive and then my two week wait. It might be a super short video, but if AF does come, then I will update you even if it's a 30 second video of whether she is, if she came because yeah, I don't want to keep you guys waiting. <laughs> that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Um, thank you again for watching and supporting me in my journey. If you are also on a journey, I would love to follow you guys as well. Um, so we can be here for each other because nobody knows what it's like more than somebody that's going through it with you. So I will definitely follow along and be there for you as well. So on that note, I will talk to you guys hopefully in a couple of days, whether it's good news or bad news. I will be seeing you guys and yeah, bye.